This will show how easy it is to create problems in various ways. When I click on Create Assignments, I see there are four ways to create problems. The first type is Math Levels. I choose a math type and math level, which will create a large general assignment. Another way I can create a problem is to click on Math Subjects. I can look at whole numbers, fractions, decimals, and rates, ratios, proportions, and percents. Let's say, for example, that I'm interested in working with money in both fractions and decimals. When I click on these, I have money problems. Another way is to choose Select Problems. If I choose All Categories, I get all the problems in the entire program. If we want to be more specific, I can break these categories down. I can then break them down further into subcategories, such as subtracting with a common denominator and adding with a common denominator. In this case, I have 7 plus 4 problems for a total of 11 problems. Another possibility is to choose a diagnostic test, which will give a diagnostic test to your student in one of two ways, a general diagnostic test or a specific diagnostic test at a grade level. Now that I know what the four different problem selection choices are, I'll go back to math subjects, look at my money problems with both fractions and decimals, click OK. This erases the previous assignment and starts with new problems.